A gay couple is breaking their silence about a dream wedding day that took a hateful turn in Coronado. New at 7, as 10 News reporter Michael Chin found out, the wedding guest did a double take when they realized where the hate was coming from. From the smiles on their faces, you can see the joy of their wedding day, a joy that soon turned. Everyone turns around and I didn't know what was going on. Into something else. Arizonans Oscar de la Salas and Gary Jackson, frequent visitors to San Diego, picked Coronado Centennial Park for their August wedding. Some 30 guests from across the country flew in, including an Arizona congresswoman. The happy couple had just walked in, taking their places right about here. The music died down, and that's when the shouting began. Every day. The shouts were loud and unmistakable. From the balcony of one of these million dollar condos, a string of homophobic slurs. Wedding musician David D'Alva. He really wanted to humiliate the people that were there. Uh, he said, uh, go home. Whenever D'Alva looked up, the balconies appeared empty, but throughout the service, the slurs kept coming. In this photo, you can see Jackson looking, turning toward the yelling. As the moment of wedded bliss approached, De La Salas, bullied as a child, was consumed with a not so blissful emotion. It was a moment of fear. I just thinking, God forbid this person has a gun and decided to open fire. A fear that lingered in his mind even as the two kissed. Weeks later, those slurs continued to linger. It's just sad that that is now ingrained for the rest of our lives in our wedding day. It took from, from me, from us, from our guest, uh, a moment of joy, a simple moment of joy. Michael Chen, 10 News. The couple did write letters to the city of Coronado and the condo's HOA and got back letters that included apologies.